Hi, welcome to the video. This is Between Time. This apparently seems to be a escape room game that actually travels through time. I absolutely love escape rooms. I love the idea of time travel. This game is perfect. If you are just as excited as I am to do this, maybe leave a like and subscribe if you're new. It would really help out. <laughs> it's been easier than I expected. I've hardly seen any security. Well, next objective to find that time machine. Right. Okay, we need some sort of puzzle thing here. Okay. So we need something here. We have a whole bunch of puzzle things that need to happen here. What is this? Okay. I don't know what that does. Oh. Okay. All right, each row and column contains three black and three white and is unique. More than two of the same colors cannot be adjacent. Okay. So we need to find a way. No, we can't have three in a row. Let's put you there. And each one has to be unique. There's three of each color, like that, okay. Let's make black, no, that can't be that way, can it? No, that'd be three in a row. Let's move this black over to here, white. Okay, so this would be that. White would have to go here black would have to go here. I don't think that counts as adjacent. Hmm. Maybe there. Oh, come on. There. Nope. I already have three whites, so I need three blacks. Okay. All right. Ooh, more. Then we have that, then that, then that, then uh, this. I think. Did we do it? No? Something's wrong? Okay, what am I missing? Nope, I guess I don't think it worked. Let's try figure. let's figure something else out. Oh, hold on. We got A and B, so there's two different codes here. A is on that. Can't open that. Hold on, let's... Ooh. Okay. Um... What is this? Oh. Oh. Did that do something? That that did something. That means we did something right. All right. Dot minus dot dot plus dot dot times dot dot times dot dot plus dot and then dot minus dot. Hmm. I'm guessing we did that correct, but we are. Let's see what's over here. Time travel can. Okay. I'm guessing we can't really do anything with that. There's another puzzle here. Oh, wait a second. Time travel matter. Okay. Can we... Can I take... No, I didn't mean to do that. Can I take this? No. Well, then... Oh, these are a whole bunch of different shapes. Time travel. Okay. New in diary. Start of AITMA. Artificial Intelligence Time Machine Assistant Project. Uh, the first time travel in Animal has been successful. We 
process with the experimentation in humans and start working on the artificial intelligence system. We have achieved the most advanced artificial intelligence on the planet with access to global da database and deep learning algorithms. With the empathy module, it, would, it will achieve an almost human behavior. The first time travel experiment with humans has gone wrong. They haven't returned yet. The project is temporary and at standstill, and the facilities are under matili ma what? military surveillance. Okay, so something went wrong. Okay, what's this? Okay. Not sure what that does, but let's see. 254. 6291. What is. Okay. I. Gosh. Oh! So that's cabinet A. That's cabinet B. One, two, three. So. No. Okay. And then there's another kind of, oh, this is a word code. Artificial intelligence generator? The project is more advanced than I expected. Jeez. All right. Another, okay, something is missing. Definitely a key. Hmm, what was this? There's a circle here. Time flux generator. No photos. Okay. Nothing on this door. Ooh. I don't know what to do. Okay, I think this is definitely our first beginning. We gotta start here somehow. Alright. Let's just go with that. I say we start there. And then... We can have two there. We can, we can have two here. We have to do that and that. Oh boy. This is quite the conundrum. Well, what does this have to do with anything? Hmm. Well, those are already there, so we can't pick those up, so let's... And then this has to go here. Can I put this here? And then that there? Three and three? Well, no, each column in row is unique. So I can't have... Same rows. I can't have two identical rows nor columns. If I keep playing around with it, will it let, will it, will I somehow stumble upon it? Oh, I can't do that. Because those will be in the way. Now I have, now I have four. Can I, nope, that'll be three in a row. Add a black there. Go to the spot. Okay. Is that good? Wait, I have to... Oh! Okay. One, two, three. So this is the exact black, white, white, black, white, black. Black. Alright. Black. Find a pickable... Let's just restart. Okay, so... This row is definitely black, white, white, black, white, black. So black, white, white, black, white, black. Okay, so maybe we can start from here. Well, so this has to go here because I can't have three in a row. 
and then this has to go this has to go there mm-hmm mm-hmm now what well there's already three whites here so three blacks have to go here all right so then I have two whites and a black I got a black and a white a black let's go this way then we have one black white white I can have a black there I can have one of each there all right so this one's already got three blacks so this one has to be that okay I th we're, we're getting somewhere and we already have three whites in this one so and then I already have three blacks in this we already have three whites so that will go there okay we have three we have two blacks and a white let's uh, three whites and that we already have three whites so that's the three blacks we have three blacks so these got to be white uh oh all right so these have the three blacks so that's got to be that and that's got to go there oh that's a shake sound I think that means we did good what is that oh what's this hey okay hold on oh this is for cabinet B it's because that's the there were the colors on there okay so that's definitely for cabinet B oh where's the thing there it is so uh, first one is orange T E M Oh, this is this gonna spell like temple or something? T E M P U Tempest. Oh, that just hit me right in the face. Oh, okay. Now I have numbers on the side of these. Seven one two three five two. Oh wait. It was this so I multiply the top two add the middle two and then subtract the bottom two okay so if we go back to here it'd be two times three one plus five and then seven minus two so two times three, that's six. One plus five is six. Seven minus two is five. All right, so then that would go for here. B is one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. And that's for B. We still need to figure out A though. That challenge, that puzzle's done this puzzle we still got the a for that what do these have to do these got to do something with each other because there's no way that it would just show those two okay okay it's six digits two five four six two nine one one two hmm Should I use another hint? I might use a hint. Start. Wait, how do I, what, where do I start? Two up, up, left, down, right. Four, five, six, two. Okay. Four, five, six, two, four, five, six, two. Four. Wait, four, five, six, two. It's in the other way. All right, so two is here. So five, four is to the left. So four, down is, six is down. Six, two is to the right. 
Nine is also to the right. One is to the right. Oh. Oh, now I have... Seems to be colors? Okay. So each color seems to... What do these do? Purple is KR. Let me write this down. Blue is SB. Yellow. ZR. Orange. NG. And green. GA. Oh, come on. Where is it? There it is. And then red is NA. Alright. So it's got to do something with the table here. So purple is KR. If I look for KR. NA is red. So that's 11. Oh wait, so each color. So purple... KR, is there a KR? KR 36. KR is 36. And then blue SB, I think that's a 51. Okay. Yellow is a ZR, that's 40. I wonder if I can put those in like an order number wise and see what happens. Oh, wait a second. No. This represents the colors in that. So red is one for sure. I know that's one. I don't remember the rest though. But then what's four, five, six? All right, let's just figure this out. One, one, three, six, three, one. How is that one? One, one, three, six, three, one. Okay, don't know how that works, but I will link that video in the description. But like, what the actual heck? I could not, I did not understand that. Anyways, we're here, let's get into A. Nine, six, three, five, two, and what's this bottom one? Two. And that will give us the code to the next here. Nope, actually, we need to get into this, see what it is. All right, for A, we need top one minus, so nine minus, Six. That'd be three. Three plus five. Eight. Two times two is four. Come on. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Man, this is some. We did it! We got it! So, what does this do? What, what is this? All right, I got a hexagon. Okay. What does the hexagon do? Where does it go? Oh, wait a second, what's this? Fate, multiple timelines, loop, okay. Oh, wait. There's a thing here. Ooh, okay. This is what this does. Okay, so we need something about this. Take a photo of that. Let's see. Bone. If we go back to here. Hmm. Okay. So this has to be, oh wow, that got big all of a sudden. That, 
then it goes to the spinny circle, but then the spinny circle then gets in a loop with that guy. And then for this one, it also goes to the eye. The eye goes to, uh, no, this goes on top. This goes to the bottom and that goes there. Yes. Oh my gosh, that was the fastest puzzle solved yet. Oh, and this is, this is the key. A brass key. So this goes to this for sure. Inventory. Uh, how do I eat? Oh, yep. So that's the brass key. Oh. And then this is where that hexagon goes. So do we need them to line up with each other? We need to line up correctly, I think. I need the three. Uh-oh. Okay, yeah, that works. I have no three here. Uh-oh. Hmm. Let's see if I can line up this. That, that does not work. Let's start here. Start from the bottom. Two. Two. That equals up. And if we have a three. For a three. No, that's not going to work. Can it? No. I need help. I need help. I'm using too many hints. Okay, one and two. That'll give me a perfect start. Okay, one and two. Perfect. Then this can go to... Ooh, 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 ooh. There it is. Oh, we got the achievement. Finally. Now let's see how to start that thing. Okay. So... I'm guessing this is... Starting Alpha Protocol. Welcome, Robert. I was waiting for you. Robert. Hello? How do you know who I am, machine? I am not a machine. I am an advanced AI connected to the future and the past. Uh -oh. You can call me Aitma. Right, Aitma. Aitma. If you're so smart, what am I doing here? Easy, Robert. Your objective is to go to the Temple of Kukul Khan, region of Mexico, 12th century, to get the Crystal Skull. Why? Wow. You seem to be well informed. Let's go there then. Understood, Robert. Establishing time coordinates. Activating time jump. Time travel completed. Oh, <laughs> my. What a strange feeling. It was as if I had been crushed and stretched like a spring. Well, it seems we've come to the right place. I'm going to get the crystal skull and get out of here. All right, I think I'm going to end it here, to be honest, if it's all right with y'all. I'm going to end this here because there's so much more, and my brain is already trying to get racked up of what just happened. If you guys want to see the next challenge maze room thing it looks like we're in the aztec world so you guys want to see that click that like let me know in the comments below i really love this i'm so excited to play more and i hope you guys enjoy it too i hope to see you all in the next one. Oh my gosh this is incredible